Racism is alive and well in this country. Yeah. Here's how I know. 400 voting, anti-voting bills have been sneak, snaking their way through the United States this year. And 30 bills have passed. Think about that. Ah, think about it. Yeah. Lawmakers have passed 30 bills 30. to stop people from voting. 30 bills that silence the voices of black and brown people, immigrants, and young voters. The worst of these bills make it illegal to give food and water to voters waiting in line and make it impossible for people to say, to have a say in the direction of our country. That is not what democracy is all about. Today we are saying enough is enough. Young people, old people, black and brown people, and people from all walks of life are coming together. We have one important message to elected officials. It's time to wake up. I march because I am tired of elected officials putting themselves first. To be honest, I am disgusted by the behavior of many of our leaders. I march because I want change, not just for me, but for everyone who comes next. My grandma said, Every generation has to earn their freedom. I believe our generations can free the generations yet to be born. Adults have failed us, so we need to take matters into our own hands. As a 13-year-old and an activist, here's my question to elected officials. Why are you in office? Are you here for power, or are you here to stop silent, or are you here to use your platform for good? Yeah. Yeah. Tell them. If you are here for good, it's time to stop silencing our voices. Right. We need critical bills passed. The Freedom to Vote Act and the John Lewis Voting Rights That's Advancement right. Act. That's These right. bills cannot wait. Yeah. And here's my message to other teens. Wherever you are, it's time to build a foundation of the country we dream of and make my grandpa's dream a reality. Yeah. Yeah.